Candlestick patterns and candlestick charts are some of the most popular charts in the trading universe because of the amount of information that they show. A single candlestick shows you the open, high, low, and close, and then it's colored green or red depending on if the price is above the open or not. But what's really important about candlestick charts is that they were founded hundreds of years ago in ancient Japan, not only because of the information they displayed, but because over time, specific candlesticks had specific patterns that would often mark turning points in buyers and sellers. Now, on TradingView, we've got a new feature or a feature that you have potentially already known about called candlestick patterns, which is just what it sounds like, the automatic detection of specific candlestick patterns, the identification of those patterns, and if you hover your mouse over a label, the background and information about such pattern. So you just saw us add these patterns to the chart and let us walk you through what we did here. We have a candlestick chart open. You can see here, it says candles. Now we are going to click indicators, the indicators, metrics, and strategies menu. We're going to want to make sure technicals are selected. Then off to the right here, there's a button that says patterns. Now we have chart patterns. This is automatically detecting patterns in technical analysis. There's a video on our YouTube channel. Please watch that if you haven't already. But there's also candlestick patterns. This is automatic detection of specific candlesticks on the chart. And if we scroll down, it will detect any of these candlestick patterns. Check it out. You can see all of the names here. These can all be found with a single click. And remember, as you trade, as you invest, as you learn more about buying and selling, sentiment, buying pressure, selling pressure, the demand, or the supply, if there's more sellers than buyers, these types of candlesticks will become increasingly important to your process. And there's also a little question mark here that says show description. So if we see Doji here and click show description, we've got access to the TradingView Help Center, which explains that specific candle. But let's go ahead and once again, click all candlestick patterns. It's now been added to our chart. And as you can see here, this D represents Doji. It's a Doji candle. And oftentimes Dojis represent indecision because look at, look at the candle here. The open and the close and where it's settled are just so tight. It didn't go anywhere. It was a battle between bulls and bears. You can barely see the candle. It's nothing but wick. Hover our mouse over Doji. When the open and close of a security are essentially equal to each other, a doji candle forms. The length of both upper and lower shadows, shadows may vary, causing the candlestick you are left with to either resemble a cross, an inverted cross, or a plus sign. Doji candles show the playout of buyer and seller indecision in a tug of war of sorts. So how cool is that? Now you have this marker on your chart. And actually, how fascinating, how fascinating is this move? If we do a quick measurement, for example, so let's go to price range from this doji to this current price. It's a 2% move to the current price since this doji, which is interesting, the bulls clearly won. And you can measure and follow along just like this. Now, reminder, when you see a BE, for example, it says engulfing here, but the B means bearish because there are bearish engulfing candles and bullish engulfing candles. So you're going to want to make sure that you pay specifically, specific close, close attention, whether it's a bearish engulfing candle or a bullish engulfing candle. And actually, correct us, this is a bullish engulfing candle because look at the candle here prior to the previous one in the amount of green, and then look at the day after. This is a rather textbook chart at this moment for all of these candlestick patterns. And what else do we have here? More engulfing. Here's another doji. We can scroll back in time to find many different candles that we want to analyze or anything that stands out. Quite frankly, there's a lot of dojis and engulfing candles on this chart, and you can do research just like this to try to find some candlestick analysis that's interesting to you. Why don't we go to Apple and take a look around? One of the best ways to learn is to add these indicators to your chart and then to dive in and give it a test run. Once again, you can do this at any point just by going, as we mentioned, to your indicators, metrics, and strategies clicking patterns, scrolling down, you've got all candlestick patterns and many 
more here. Now, remember, when we select all candlestick patterns, it means that it is looking for every candlestick pattern in the lexicon of candlestick patterns and that we have listed in this menu here. But if you only wanted to see dojis, for example, but remember, you could pick anything here, gravestone dojis. You could pick these long lower shadow shadows, long upper shadows, anything of the sorts, but let's click doji. You can now search for specific candlesticks. And how cool is that? You even get these shaded points in time, which will specifically show you the dojis that are happening. You just can't miss them with this. And Keep in mind, you have your indicator at the top left here where the indicator's uh, you know, st uh, status is, and you can always open the settings to make some customizations. So as I mentioned, you see this gray highlight here to show you where the doji took place. You have the capability to change this color to anything that you want. This way, you just can't miss it. Look, this is a little over the top to have this big, you know, bright, pink vertical line, but at least we can't miss it. And we can now share a chart on our, uh, you know, social feeds or our newsletters or anything of the sort and say, look at all these dojis and look what happened after such dojis. You can make the assessment that back in early 2023, the bulls really took advantage of these dojis and it's been really nothing but up since those moments of indecision. Of course, this doji here did climb higher, but it looks as if the trend has changed some. And pay attention that there's not a single doji in this sideways action. So who's in charge? This type of analysis is entirely up to you. You have the capabilities to perform such research. One more time, indicators, metrics, and strategies, technicals, patterns. And then, of course, you have your candlestick patterns. Select the pattern you want. And if you're looking to learn more or are looking for bullish or bearish candles, well, you can find these abbreviations here that say bullish or bearish. Open the question mark and instantly learn exactly what you need to learn about these candles. So thanks for watching. Go get started with this indicator.